Hi, Tracy Phillips here. It's Flying Tea Tip Tuesday. Today I'm going to talk a lot more about clubs. You see, we have a lot of new golfers that come out to Flying Tea, and unfortunately, what they try to do is they take the longest club. The longest club on third floor is going to be a three wood. A lot of people on second, first floor, they take the driver. That's a bad mistake because for a new golfer, they're taking the longest club, which means it's a lot harder to hit because of that longer club. Also, we're dealing with the amount of loft that's on a golf club. You see, at Flying T, it's all about launching the ball up in the air. So, I always recommend for new golfers coming out to Flying T, whether you're men or women, or even juniors, it's very important that you start with a lofted club, such as the pitching wedge here. This ideally has a lot more loft. You can see by the angle of the, of the club, pitch backwards behind the shaft. This is loft that helps propel the ball up in the air. So for new golfers, this is something that we want to make sure we see. We don't want to drive the ball into the mat or hit top shots. We always want to get the ball up in the air. So using a pitching wedge or an eight iron for a new golfer is very important to gain confidence of seeing the ball launch up in the air, which means our machines will be tracking the ball a lot easier than to jump right in and try to hit that long driver with a big head. I know it's a bigger head, but keep in mind, it's a lot longer golf club, and most people that start out hitting the golf ball with a long club tends to hit the ground first before they hit the ball. So then what they do is they react with their body during the course of the swing by standing up. Now we end up topping the ball. So again, it's a vicious circle there. We want to make sure next time you come out to Flying T, or if this is your first time out, instead of pulling out that three wood or that driver, we want to make sure we go to a pitching wedge or an eight iron Go to the lofted club, put it on a slight tee, get the ball launching up in the air, and then gradually work down into your longer clubs. The next club I'd recommend once you have the confidence is what we call a hybrid. This is a lofted club. It's still bigger. It's a wood or well, basically a hybrid. It's a, a slash between an iron and a wood. It's a smaller profile club. Again, easier to launch up in the air. So next time you're out flying tee, start with a wedge, Crawl your way into the hybrid before you tackle that long driver or three-wheel.